holds onto the door frame, wraps her leg around it. But he finally gets her out and then he literally carries her from there. A woman desperately tries to escape her kidnapper and it is all caught on video. Good evening again, everyone. I'm Brad Johansson. And I'm Paula Todi. Security video you'll see only on Local 12 shows a mother fighting for her life with the father of her child. She'd already been punched and bitten before jumping out of the car that he was driving. Local 12's Deborah Dixon tells us how people nearby and then the victim herself helped police find the woman after her abduction. The doggy daycare center on Burnett Avenue must have seen a good place to escape and hide. It was, but not for long. You can see Donovan Clark come inside looking for the mother of his child, a woman we're not identifying because she's an abuse victim. Watch what happens when Clark finds her. He starts carrying her out. She shouted out enough information about Clark for an employee to call 911. Now what looks like a fight for her life begins. She puts up a very good fight. Um, she was holding on to anything she could grab. Uh, wrapped her leg around the door frame. The video shows Clark carry her out of the business to a waiting car driven by a friend. Police quickly moved to compare Donovan Clark mugshot with the video. We know that she's in harm's way and we have to, it has to be happening r really quick. Police officers spread out going to different locations where Donovan Clark might take her. He didn't get far because it was here on Central that Officer David Hunt spotted the car described by witnesses going across the Western Hills viaduct inside. He could see the woman pounding on the window to get his attention. And it did. Clark was arrested after a traffic stop. His victim is now safe. If you watch the video and you can see what he does and he's willing to do in broad daylight in the public, how he's willing to manhandle her um, forcefully through the door, slam her on the ground, slam her against the door frame. Um, you can only imagine what he would have done if he'd have got her somewhere. The victim had visible injuries when the police uh, interviewed her. She said she had uh, been bitten on the right leg, uh, punched her in the left side of the face. Clark appeared in court this morning on charges of abduction and domestic violence. He has 11 prior felony convictions uh, and at least three domestic violence convictions. Three previous domestic violence convictions. Police believe this video is evidence to back a fourth. Deborah Dixon, Local 12 News. The driver of the car is charged with complicity. The car used in the